Ladies and gentlemen, my name is Erica Kazmarczyk. I'm very honored to be here speaking with you all tonight. I would like to thank the planning committee for having me. I'm here to talk to you all about health care insurance coverage, which is an issue of great importance, not just for me, but for everyone. Health care insurance is a life and death issue, without exaggeration. Health care coverage greatly increases a person's chances of using important preventative care services such as well visits and preventative screenings that can prevent and detect serious illnesses before they progress. I'm here to introduce to you all a man who has changed what access to health care means to us in America. Before he became president, our health care system was in a state of crisis. Through a benchmark legislation called the Affordable Care Act, or better known as Obamacare, he helped to expand insurance coverage to include 20 million Americans. Before the, before the Affordable Care Act, our health care our healthcare system was in a state of crisis. The cost of health care was rising exponentially. Insurance premiums from 2002 to 2008 increased by 58%. There were millions of people who lacked insurance coverage. This included many people who had pre-existing conditions, which prevented them from being able to purchase insurance coverage. Many working people made too much money to qualify for Medicaid, but were unable to pay for insurance offered through their employer, if their employer even offered insurance. President Obama helped millions of these people gain access to important health insurance coverage through the Affordable Care Act. The individual mandate required citizens that met certain conditions to purchase insurance coverage or they would have to pay a fine. This extra revenue from the individual mandate helped offset the costs that insurance companies incurred from having to cover people with pre-existing conditions which traditionally cost more to cover. Millions of low-income Americans additionally were covered through their state's Medicaid expansion. There are currently 72 million insured through Medicaid and CHIP, an increase of about 15 million since 2013. Low-income Americans are one of the most at-risk groups of people for being uninsured, which can lead to a plethora of health care discrepancies. Millions of Americans were also able to purchase health care through the federally and state facilitated marketplaces. By January 2016, about 11 million people had purchased their insurance through these marketplaces and exchanges. Through these increases in health insurance coverage, President Obama has helped fight the fight for adequate health care and good health for all citizens. Through his changes, the uninsured rate fell among the non-elderly from 18.2% in 2009 to 10.5% in 2015. So not only did, o did President Obama's Affordable Care Act increase insurance company inc insurance coverage, but it also gave, them, gave people a significantly higher chance at living healthier lives. So without any further ado, please join me in welcoming our 44th President of the United States, President Barack Obama.